Hey everybody, it's Crazy Bean Carol. How you doing? Today I'm going to be unboxing this Smart Egg puzzle. So you might recognize this type of puzzle. Uh, I actually have uh, two of these types of um, Smart Egg puzzles already. I have the skull one and the lava one. I have videos about these on my channel, so if you uh, wanna check them out, you can. But as you can see, these eggs look a little bit um, lame compared to this egg. Uh, this egg is a two-layered labyrinth. These ones are only one-layered. So I'm gonna check this out and see what it's like. So as you can tell, this puzzle looks pretty epic. Um, it has just like these black dragons all over it, and there's uh, kind of a gold color around it. I just thought this one looked so cool compared to the other ones. I mean, these little smart eggs look so gimpy compared to this big one. So the idea of this puzzle is that there are these sort of pathways in this egg, and you have this wand that you stick in at the top, and then you try to move it around through the maze to try to get it out through the bottom. So because this is a two layer labyrinth one, there is the egg labyrinth and there's this sort of inner labyrinth that spins at the bottom. So yeah, this sort of just adds a whole new layer of difficulty to the puzzle. It's super nice that it comes with a stand and a place to put your wand. So I guess all there's left to do is to just try it out and see if I can solve it. So just stick the wand in at the top and then move it around through the maze. So I'm already getting stuck on how to actually stick the wand in. Uh, these smart eggs I didn't have too much trouble figuring out, but because this one has a inner labyrinth that I'm not too sure how it works, um, I'm not <laughs> I'm not too good at getting this wand in the egg. Okay, so it's been quite a while and I have managed to solve uh, the egg, but I have to say I really despise this puzzle. So this is my fault, but the first thing I hate about this is that um, I was really stupid when I bought this puzzle and uh, got the hardest two-layered egg there is as my first two-layered egg. Uh, I just thought it looked cool, so that's why I got it, but I really shouldn't have started with it. The second thing I dislike about this puzzle is that it's really difficult. Um, well, that's pretty obvious because it's the hardest of the two-layered puzzles. but. Um, What's really frustrating is that if you mess up on this puzzle, then uh, you're kind of just stuck in whatever position you are left off in forever because uh, this puzzle has an inner mechanism that basically how it works is you can pull it out, uh, pull this bottom part out to open up the inside mechanism or you can rotate this clockwise or counterclockwise to move the inner mechanism. Um, but at some parts, the, the wand just gets stuck, and it makes it really difficult to sort of work the internal mechanism. So for example, right here, I seem to have made a wrong move, and the wand is stuck in here. Um, I can move this up and down, um, but when I try to get it back into this correct position, I really don't know where I am. I can't really close this anymore. I'm tr if I try to maneuver it, uh, you can try to look into the internal mechanism of the puzzle and uh, you're kind of just stuck there. A lot of the times I can't even open this bottom part when I'm stuck and uh, I just have to like just jiggle it a bunch of times to try and uh, make it come out, which doesn't usually work. So yeah, now I'm just stuck here and I can't get the wand out. Also, for some reason, now this thing won't close. The wand is totally out of the way. I'm pulling it all the way back, um, but this thing just won't close. So I don't know if there's just something wrong with the egg but it's really frustrating. So now that this is actually forever stuck in this hole, uh, I really don't think it's possible for me to get it out because uh, the egg is not only stuck in this position, but it is also broken. Um, right here, this internal piece snapped. Um, when I first opened the puzzle, I could tell that this part was poorly glued, but I sort of just let it go. Oh, yeah, that wasn't not supposed to happen. But yeah, I could tell that this part was poorly glued, so I super glued it um, back with just a little super glue, uh, and it actually came apart again. And I wasn't being like harsh with the egg at all, um, but this thing just won't close, so I don't know if there's just something wrong with the egg. So yeah, to me, the only really good thing about this puzzle is how it looks. 
um, it would just be cool to put it on display. Um, but that's pretty much it. It's pretty flimsy too, um, which is expected because it is an egg and it has a lot of like holes um, and gaps in it. Um, so I have to just try to be more um, careful with it because it is super delicate, um, but it is kind of annoying. Whenever I super glue this, I have to make sure that it's not bumpy at all when it dries because if it is, it'll sort of catch and then this inner part won't be able to go in. I think it's actually getting stuck on the super glue again. Uh, as you can see, it's not really coming out that easily. Okay, so now the egg looks really bad, but it doesn't uh, get stuck anymore, so that's good. Well, this is just lovely. Base is being super glued and probably will never stay together and the stick is stuck in the hole. <clears throat> well, I guess until I get this wand out of the hole, I won't be able to put it on this stand, which is what it's used for. Um, yeah, this is great. But anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys next time on Crazy Cuban Carol. Bye.